Andres, is God a hedonist? I would say so, yes. I mean, all of the in evidence indicates that pretty much every animal with a nervous system on this planet has a pleasure-pain axis. It's fascinating to see even tiny creatures like flatworms or tardigrades, in a sense, response to uh, recreational drugs like uh, alcohol and opioids and amphetamines. And you can actually see they cause a reinforcement signal and, and they wiggle differently <laughs> under those conditions. Recently, it was found out that octopodes uh, actually respond to MDMA in, in a way that is pretty similar to humans. They become more cuddly. Um, in, in some sense, the um, reward circuitry, the pleasure pain axis, seems to be kind of a unifying motivational system uh, across the animal kingdom. And maybe God is not optimizing for ultimate uh, pleasure and happiness because uh, the suffering is also being used for, for motivational purposes. But the fact that the hedonic axis is all over the place, that, that seems, to be, it doesn't mean, seems to be a fact. And um, I would add, this is the case as well in humans, even though a lot of humans don't necessarily know that they're pursuing pleasure, they're still doing so in, in, a, in a fairly subtle way. So it could be that the nervous system, anything with the nervous system is pursuing pleasure. Yes. Yeah. Well, cool.